सो हाई डियर कैप्रिकॉन अ वेरी वेरी गुड आफ्टरनून टू यू गैस दिस इज अंजलि टैरो एंड दिस इज अ जनरल रीडिंग फॉर ऑल द कैप्रिकॉन सन मून मीन राइजिंग कीप इन माइंड दिस इज जनरल इट माइट और माइट नोट रेजोनेट विद यूर द फर्स्ट प्लेस द सेकंड थिंग द रोल्स कैन बी रिवर्स एनी टाइम थर्ड थिंग दिस इज अ रीडिंग फ्रॉम ट्वेंटी फर्स्ट टिल द एंड ऑफ जून सो लेट स्टार्ट योर पार्टनर्स करंट फीलिंग्स फॉर यू राइट नाउ आर लेट सी कैप्रिकॉन लेट सी वट इज हैपनिंग Two of Cups. Wow. Somebody feels like you are their soulmate, and somebody feels like you are the victory. You are working very good right now, and you are attaining some name and fame and success. Might be you are the apple of somebody else's eyes, also, right? So you feel this person is feeling like you are their soulmate. You really make them happy, but you have a different kind of fan base as well. You are kind of a famous person as well. Okay, personality as well. Let me clarify the Two of Cups, honey. Ten of Cups and the Devil, my God, and the Eight of Pentacles. I do see that this person, right? This person feels like you are their family. You are the, you have the potential to become a family. You have the potential to become a husband or a wife. And this person is kind of low key obsessed with you, right? This person is kind of obsessed with you and with this idea of making things work out between you and this person, no matter what. This person is obsessed with the idea of having a family with you, having a long-term future with you, having a marriage with you, and uh, it could be possible that this person is feeling like obsessed with you. This is you, Capricorn. This is you only in between. This person feels like uh, you are their spouse, you are their man, you are their woman, but they are kind of obsessed with this idea of you having uh, them, you know, or you know, uh, them having you forever in their life, and they are trying to work on this situation. Ah, I was about to sneeze. So yes, I do see this person uh, ready to work on this connection, no matter how hard it is to get you. But they feel like getting you as a spouse, as a partner. Wow, nice. So Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, and Capricorn and Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Let's see what you feel for this person, Capricorn. Let's see what you feel for this person. Six of Swords, okay. You are feeling like surely, but slowly you are moving on or moving ahead towards karma. What are in your uh, in your connection? Or it could be possible that you are feeling a sense of relief in this connection right now. Right now, you are feeling like slowly but surely things are moving ahead with peace. This is what you are feeling. Might be because uh, there was no peace in this connection. There was a lot of fights and conflicts going on between you guys, and now the connection is transforming, and now you are moving towards a peaceful. you know future with this person i have to clarify this could be dealing with a gemini libra and aquarius let me clarify page of wands and the three of cups and the queen of wands yes see i feel like there's a reconciliation between you guys right from the page of wands from this friendship i feel like you started as a friend there is a reconciliation and now this connection is moving towards more serious things Right, uh, Queen of Wands is like uh, not that much serious. It's kind of enjoying the company of each other, flirting with each other, looking good, looking gorgeous, and uh, moving forward with confidence and taking a risk again with each other. Right, this is someone who is a risk taker. I do see that uh, this connection is moving towards calm water right now, and you are feeling at peace after a lot of fight and conflicts and all this shit. You are like, I am at peace finally. Things are moving ahead. from a friendship level things are moving to the next level and there's a reconciliation and celebration you you guys are celebrating each other's company you are you guys are celebrating in like, like going to parties and night outs and all this beautiful beautiful energy so could be dealing with aries leo sagittarius or cancer pisces scorpio let's see what this person wants from you capricorn they feel like you feel like you know this thing things are moving ahead in your life this is good okay let's see what you feel uh, what this person wants from you capricorn let's see the moon okay i feel like this person wants you to come out of this depressing state of mind or come out of this depressive pattern that you follow you know i feel like might be you are uh, following a pattern from a very long time you are always depressed you are not happy about the situation no matter what have what happened you always feel depressed you always feel like no things are not happening things are not good and you hold back a lot of things you know you hold back your emotions they want you to open up to them they want you to talk to them openly and honestly this is what this person wants from you So let me clarify the moon.
द स्ट्रेंथ कार्ड द नाइट ऑफ कार्ब्स एंड द हैंड मैन यस दिस पर्सन सी यू आर होल्डिंग बैक अ लॉर्ड ऑफ फीलिंग्स दिस पर्सन वॉन्ट्स यू टू बी करेज एंड ओपन अप यू नो दिस टेक करेज टू ओपन अप टू समबडी यू नो एंड दिस टेक्स हेल लॉर्ड ऑफ करेज टू ओपन अप टू समबडी एंड दिस पर्सन फील्स लाइक यू नीड करेज to tell them that how much you love them or that you have emotions for them and they want you to unstuck this stuck energy between you guys and this person wants you to come out of this depression this uh, uh bad phase that uh, this uh, you know constantly sinking into some kind of depressive kind of energy this is what this person wants you wants from you see this person wants you exactly they want you to work on this connection by opening up and be completely honest emotionally you know so could be dealing with the uh, pisces could be dealing with the leo uh, and cancer pisces scorpio let's see what you what you want from this person right now let's see let's see what you want from this person sun you want happiness with this person you want to grow with this person you want expansion and growth with this person beautiful you want to grow with this person and you want happiness nothing but happiness and you want to open up you know you have created a boundary uh, uh, like towards you and uh, and you're like i want to open up to this person slowly but surely and and i want to find the happiness inner happiness at least you you want inner happiness inner peace from this person from this connection let me clarify let's see let's clarify the sun card could be dealing with the leo here ten of swords and the knight of wands and the king of cups yeah you want to end the painful cycle you know you want to end this flirtiness you want to end this on and off situation you you are like i am done with this on and off situation i am done with this in and out situation and i just want to love this person i just want to feel the love i just want to feel the connection i'm no longer in uh, games or uh, i'm no longer interested in any kind of flirtiness or any kind of uh, casual relationships or something i am just uh, i just want growth and happiness and i just want this person and me to be in a happily committed relationship king of cups and the sun beautiful energy you want to end this flirtiness and end this on and off situation and this casual type of situation and be in a solid committed happy relationship nice gemini libra aquarius and uh, aries leo sagittarius cancer pisces scorpio and leo Let's see what to expect from this person. The, this is a very beautiful reading. Very beautiful reading. Touch wood. Let's see what is coming towards you till the end of June. Let's see what is coming towards you till the end of June, honey. Hi, Rafan. Whoa! You can expect some kind of proposal coming towards you for marriage. Oh God! If not for marriage, you can expect you know proposal. See, page of Pentacles and the Hi, Rafan. a proposal for marriage is coming your way wow so happy for you capricorn so so happy for you let's clarify the higher point king of pentacles queen of cups and the page of cups beautiful see uh the the, uh, the stable you know the earth sign the uh, taurus virgo capricorn is meeting the lover boy the lover girl and having a good start having a good news again this is a double confirmation that a marriage proposal is coming your way from the king or from the queen okay and this connection is made in heaven kind of one of you is very mature and one of you is very emotional and take care of the emotions of the other person this is a match made in heaven kind of energy beautiful energy of marriage and happiness coming your way touch wood this is a very beautiful reading and that made me really happy so god bless you <laughs> I forgot to pull the cards for you as a guidance for you guys. What is the guidance for Capricorn people? I feel like you should be happy. You need you don't don't need any kind of guidance. Just happy. <laughs> nice. First is helpful people are around you. You know there are lots of helpful people around you. Take help for others if needs. Recovery. Some kind of recovery is happening. Like from some uh, might be some kind of health recovery, some kind of funds recovery, or something is happening. Okay, and the third is uh, success. You, Capricorn, I'm so fucking happy for you guys. I just can't describe how much happy I am for you guys. This is beautiful. This is the most beautiful reading I have ever done for Capricorn till today. So thank you so much for tuning in. I'll see you soon in the next video. Bye bye. Take care. God bless you. Namaste.